welcome all of you to the one half hour chemistry magic show 2009 picnic day TV special. Today, we bring you the excitement and magic and triumphs in chemistry, but before we do that, we must tell you that we're all wearing goggles and safety glasses, safety goggles, whatever it may be, because we are professionals here and we know how to do these things. We recommend that you don't do them at home. Chemicals are dangerous. For all you don't know, I'm totally blind. I learned the safety lesson the hard way. And if a blind guy has safety goggles on, that means he's going to be really scared or get out of here. Now, we would like to invite the very stereotypical chemistry professor, Professor Astrolo, to show you a little bit about nitrogen. Which boils at negative 320 degrees Fahrenheit, so it is essentially liquid air. One of the more exciting things. Take it away. So liquid air looks pretty much like water, only that it's minus 200 degrees Celsius cold. And so if you stick things in there, they get instantly frozen, and they become very, very brittle. So like these flowers, for example, you see, they are oh, at minus 200 degrees, and if I touch them, oh. Not like an ordinary flower. A little bit earlier, I already put a little banana in here to show you uh, what happens to the banana. Uh, you can actually use a banana like that to do some handiwork at home. Uh, take a banana, and it's going to be If you, if you dip it in there, will change their properties dramatically. So this is like flexible tubing. If I put this in there, uh, it takes a little bit. It makes the uh, liquid air boil. And in the, in the process, the plastic becomes very, very cold and will become also very, very brittle. So let's take this out and put it against the desk here. See what happens? It's uh, like glass. One amazing property of liquid nitrogen is that you can uh, actually numb your fingers with it. So I'm going to hold my, my thumb into this. And it kind of hurts a little bit at the beginning. But <laughs> I had to practice a little bit. But you know what? After a while, the feeling goes away. You don't feel it. <laughs> but the problem is, because things change their uh, materials properties when they get cold, uh, fingers can become very, very brittle. And you want to be very, very careful. Very, very careful if you do handy work at home, like, you know, nailing a hammer and then... Oh! 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 All right, you don't need to be afraid. So then stay down forever. All right, give it up for the best of all, everybody. All right, thank you. Thank you. Chemistry Club Show. We. This is the Brian and Eric shopping, shopping experience. experience. All right, all right. So I don't know about you guys, but I love coffee. Love coffee, it. Coffee, coffee, gotta coffee, have it. Enough. Gotta have it. So good, especially on picnic day. You know, getting up wide early to do all sorts of friendly things. You know? Yep. All right. So what we have here, though, we have been working in a lab for the past three and a half years to make the ultimate coffee can. It'll extend the life of your coffee by up to ten times. Count it. Ten, ten times. times. This is going to be last ten times longer. Ten. In addition to, last, to keeping up the life of your coffee, it's impermeable to the elements. That's right. We've engineered this can to be unsusceptible to fire. Watch. You can just put your can, put your coffee, you can light it. Just watch. All right, watch it go. It's going to give right. you that oven roasted flavor, that aroma that you that <laughs> sought after for all coffee teams. Am I no. right, Eric? Now remember, this has taken years of painstaking research so that way you can enjoy the benefits in your own house, your own home. <laughs> um, well, all right, so we haven't had all the bugs worked out. We'll work it out for you guys. And uh, we might be back later in the show for you guys. So. Yeah, for the bang of the Easy recipes, easy fun, what a great time. Let's 
start out with a beverage. Everybody likes it. That'll be Coca-Cola. Hey, who likes to buy Coke? Man, it's expensive. And you know, we just, we all of us got fed up with buying Coke. So we decided to make our own. We have 10 second Coca-Cola. I mean, that a ship from a plant, pay $3 a liter or whatever they charge at the asylum. We don't like that. So we're gonna have our ex experts here make you some Coke. All right, what do you guys think is the first ingredient to go in Coca-Cola? What is it? Oh, uh, come on, it's liquid. I heard water. How about water? Do we have water? All right, water. Water, excellent. Second ingredient, what is it? We drink it every day. Sweet. Come on, sugar. Yeah, yeah very good, sugar. Go to our sugar. Now mix that up for us, guys. Mix it up, give it a nice shake. And we have another secret ingredient that we're going to add that we don't necessarily want to tell you guys about right away. But make the best Coke ever. He's going to add it. We're going to give it a shake. And then once he sets it down, yeah, more sugar and a bunch of caffeine, right? Once he sets it down, we're going to count. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten.